Hey everybody, Brandon from Colorado Go Guide here. Come along, I'm headed out with my buddy Disco and the Princess of Darkness. We're going to clear some of the Colorado Trail this past May. Section 11, it's one of my favorite heights, hikes to access Cache Creek and Clear Creek for gold prospecting. Come along. This is a pretty awesome packer saw. I got it for my buddy Scotty, who's a gold prospector. He's had it for 50 years, and he got it from an old timer in Alaska. I'm gonna chop some trees with it. Well, it's probably bouncy when I'm hiking. Going downhill is nice. Woohoo! Oh, it's been stormy. There's another bow down here. I might be able to just pick up and move this one. We'll see. Success! We chopped it. Threw it out of the way. Onwards. There's a big tree across the trail down here. It's gonna take some effort. Oh yeah, this is the one. Fell right across the trail. This is gonna take some effort to cut. I guess you can sneak under. Oh lord. Oh, kinda stuck. Boy. Well, maybe we'll leave that one. This has got to be cut, though. We got to get it. This tree is blocking my morning walk down to Cache Creek from my favorite camp. If y'all have seen previous videos, you probably know I don't like to camp down at Cache Creek by the digging. I like to camp about a mile and a half up the hill. There's a really nice spot up there. Oh, I'm making progress. It's hard work. Oh, Lord. Took all the limbs. We topped it. Cuff, and I don't know if I can pivot it. I think I'm going to have to cut it again over here. Lower. Oh, we even saved the trail sign. Woohoo! Woohoo! Oh, that was good exercise. Yeah! Disco POD and I cleared about eight miles of the trail this day. They are volunteer maintainers of Section 11 of the Colorado Trail for the Colorado Trail Foundation. These big blowdowns often have to be cut twice. It is a lot of work, but these guys are rock stars. They are super strong and can cut all day. This saw you see us using most frequently here is a silky katana boy. It is awesome. Now we'd be allowed to use chainsaws in here, but we gotta carry them a long way. These silky saws are sharp and fast and nice and light. Woohoo, they got it. Now we just gotta roll it out the way. And for the weight, I'd rather carry a beer to drink than a hammer. Disco's pretty good at driving in those nails with a rock. Works great.
Woo. I'm feeling it. All right, great success. Great. All cleared out for the day. Now we've just got about a three, four mile walk back to the car down to Clear Creek. Another one of my favorite prospecting spots at the south end of this section. Clear Creek, good gold to be found. Thanks for watching everybody. This is one of my favorite sections of trail and from here I access Cache Creek and Clear Creek. Like and subscribe if you will. There's lots of videos of finding gold in those spots.